Hey Aquarius, welcome back to my place. Okay, with the breath they come. Your message is love is in the air. Oh, is it because Valentine's is around? Maybe. But but I feel like for most of you, it was destined to be in this time frame. In this time frame. So, universe decided the month of Feb. Possible. However, these are timeless readings. But I feel like your calling is like with the breath they come. So love is in the air for many of you for sure for some they're going to reconnect for supposed to be for some they are going to just confess it feels not a feather feather but I've, I've mentioned in other readings as well but it feels it feels though or it felt though that it's some sort of part of the feather white feather in the air Giving you the giving you some signs, signals, synchronicity, like gestures here. I can see that very strong. <laughs> I can see that very strong. Do you see this? Is this four of cups energy? They are waiting to take this to fly towards you and give you that cup because they feel they miss you. But also they are. In the phase of like what should I do because they're looking to the talks they may be having certain kind of possible regrets but they are thinking of like that you are their king of heart like king of cups or emotional or queen so this crow is definitely in love with you I'm telling you that oh they're in love with you so love is in the air. Also, I want to talk about, of course, this is going to be out. Oh, it's very interesting. Um, th th this is about, if you're listening to this after 9th of Feb, it's connected with the new moon. And I feel, if I'm not wrong, as per the information, it's in Aquarius. If I'm wrong somewhere, because I'm not an astrologer, okay, tell me, let me declare that. But I feel like I read it. I read it, the line, uh, uh, the information is, of course, we need information about that because I'm not an astrologer, even astrologers do that, right? So they need to be correct with that because they're their profession, right? They need full information, they read, and they have knowledge of that. Anyways, as a psychic and a clairvoyant, the strong, the strong vibe of someone is coming towards you. So this is going to affect this is going to end. It's your season as well still on, right, for Aquarius's. So before it goes and the Piscean season starts, like, it's going to affect us. It is. So the more we know about certain situation, you're going to know more about this person. That's what I'm calling it as like a situation that is prevailing between you both. I feel that they are in love because love is in the air. With no doubt. I feel like the reading is done. Oh, are we done? Are we done? Are we? No. Oh, you're showing me the voyage. You know what? The voyage is going to start. The journey shall begin. For many of you, it's love. Yes, that's what I see. Love is in the air. You're going to receive the message. Page of Swords is happening. I told you this person is coming very strong. And they're going to tell you exactly what's on their mind. Knight of Pentacles. Could be Taurus or go Capricorn you're dealing with. Uh, deep desires. An offer that is here. Like somewhere. You don't even see that. They're preparing it, wrapping it up. And they're going to be out and loud with their feelings so your knight is arriving no matter what phase they are in whether king or queen or knight or page but i feel very strong that mm, they're not in the page straight state no no not the page stage but i don't go with the word to word and pages are this and that i do read it in psychic way but i feel very strong that they are going to take certain transport or source to connect with you to convey to you i told you they're flying from there holding it up 
This is for you. So, love is in the air. Wait and watch. Something is growing in their garden. You're going to pick up. Pick up means they are going to pick up. You're going to pick up. This is a this is consistent love. Consistent love. Oh yes, they are going to come. This is three of wands though, but still we need the flip. They are going to make the bridge. They are going to make the effort. They are going to come your way. If this is for you, you are doing it. But I feel like this person is coming. Please ignore the sounds. Ignore anything around love matter. <laughs> because it's not going to matter. It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter when they are in love with you. It doesn't matter other things. People who agree, who disagree, it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. You matter, they matter. I'm not satisfied. I want flip. Please give me the flip from. Be ready. There's a messenger. Messages are coming. This is a crow deck. Arrival. Indicating. Crow, crow. Not the proper crowing, but yes. That's your card. Someone is manifesting you. First message. Someone is. Maybe it's about you as well. But the manifestation is working from both the sides, I suppose. This is about the trial, the effort they're going to do. Okay? The magician. Could be any sign. Could be any sign. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Could be any sign you're dealing with. But this is the one who is going to balance their thought processes which is very much required and their emotions in order to take action towards this situation so right now they might be going with the phase of balancing their stress or something that they've been thinking about and they are going to balance their everything here that's what i see and they're going to act on it the magician they are manifesting you or you are they they are doing it I'm telling you that Love is in the air. So they love you. They love you. They're going to lock the deal with you. Like, listen to me, baby. Uh, darling, listen to me. I'm in love with you. Their eyes are stuck on you. <laughs> they are, yes, they are. Why is this good? It curves. Oh, my God. <sighs> I'm getting a blur sudden get ready for a fast communication here knight of swords could be taurus uh, why i keep on saying taurus or capricorn this is gemini libra aquarius is it like a heavy taurus or capricorn around you you're going to hear from someone conversation messages even real time meeting if you are not if you're far you're going to plan for that if you're near you're going to meet it depends right but look at this. The speed is going to be so much. Something is going to be speeding up here. Oh, these are beautiful cards. There's sincerity. That was just a card could be Libra, but I feel very strong that someone is, they know what they're doing. Speakable in the future. Wow. Oh, why? They know what they're doing. They don't want to lose you. Something is connected with the past. Something that was broken, gone wrong with you and the person, like when you had the conversation. But why? Love is in the air. It's going to be challenging five of pentacles searching for the right partner they've done all this time okay but they have things to talk the challenges they want to talk about why this is here
Okay. They're saying just take another deck and take out one card. Five of Pentacles. They want to talk about things they messed up in the past. That is for sure. Okay, this is indicating me that disturbing phase that you went through with this person. But love is in the air. I'm, oh my. That's why I kept on saying earth elements. This is a Virgo, the hermit. They're looking for you or they know they're going to contact you. The hermit is in the picture where someone is in the energy of like contemplating possible or not being too much open about because they're keeping close attention to you. But also they are, they are coming. They are coming. Arrival. Also an apology is coming. With the free will, no complications here. I told you, this eight of wands is going to be a genuine thing here. This person is going to have conversation with you. They are manifesting you. Okay. Uh, but not just manifesting. They also have this inside power to do something. Like, you know, I'm not, trick I'm not a trickster here. Okay. But yes, I am. Um, going to talk okay there may be some talks here happened that was like little manipulative or something that you never liked it or you didn't like it like it in the past I feel this person is about to talk send you the messages or contact you something that you people need to discuss in the future is it like we are going to have troubles of compatibility something has to do with compatibility here how it's going to work if it's going to work this five of pentacles is possible connected with this person. Cold and rough moments possible they're going through. The disturbing phase they're going through. They want to settle this. Okay. They're looking for your presence. They have a lot of care and love for you. I'm telling you that. This person is looking forward to meet you, talk to you. They're going to make a move. Yes, they're sincere about you. Oh, yes, they're sincere about you. The emperor. Could be an Aries. They are sincere about you. All I can say, I don't want to even exaggerate on this matter, but yes, they want this thing to work. They cannot. They can't. And they don't want to lose you. They don't want to, I feel. If it's not being like, they may have a little bit of no, um, cold aura exactly like little um not a cold aura yes but a more of like stone like they might have done this something here something shake up will happen in your life regarding this person because love is definitely in air and i told you this person is in love with you if same feelings are there they want to take the responsibility they want to commit and they want to talk a lot about you and them. This is a card of like wounded situation that might have happened and they're regretting it. They're looking for you, but it's already done. You cannot undo it. So what you can do is talk about the matter if you want to talk about the matter. It, it does come all the time. <sighs> Sudden contact. Something happened and they want to talk about it. SHIT shit happened some talk conversation whatever it surrounds around that someone is having a mirroring like first mirror is telling that they know that you're the one so you mirror each other uh they know you're the one you, if you know your intuition is telling you the other one but the mirror is also the truth and it's about being honest with self and they may be having that reflection or you but if they are having that reflection of what went wrong they need they are going to search for you and they're going to have conversation with you mirror is about being clear and being honest okay it's also um, reflecting on the situation whatever happened time is tick 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 happening they don't want to lose out on this opportunity basically not you clock time time pressure in a rush something is going to happen here in a rush someone is going to contact you and there's a pressure on them because what happened so if it happened something was negative here um yes they want to make it right and if you want 
make it right. Uh, suggestion. Keep your temper in control. Don't say anything that you will regret later. I feel like it does contain some kind of energy with temper issues with this person as well. Nature, communication. I feel like what I heard right away was never communicate, okay? But the thing here is like this something is changing. Is, uh, it is changing. Love is in the air, okay? So it's something is uh, never communicate is turning into nature communicate. I feel like it's saying go with the flow, but let's see the words. Flower energies, fairy energies, elemental messengers. I believe very strong that all the elements going to be in the favor of the situation because they want you people to connect or reconnect on a certain level to prosper and to, to, to know each other and to uh, find flaws in a wounded or situation which is not working or you thought it's not going to work okay so something is going to go with the flow and with the elements and all like air water earth and fire everything is going to be working with this they are sending the messages telling you know anything is happening possible synchronicities connectivity it happens because it is supposed to be happening you cannot ask questions all the time oh, oh give me the proof if you believe you believe okay yes your angels are giving the messages to them yes the cupid is working if you believe you believe you do not ask questions from that world you receive they're going to whisper oh yes you can ask like give me the sign and they're going to they're not going to come and give you the proof proof in a way of like on this planet earth everything works on oh give me the proof okay but the proof is synchronicity proof is they're guiding you right that's the proof so nature communication something is going to bloom out of the blue out of the blue because you know intuitively but yes Like, I feel like nature, fairies, element, everything is going to work. Wake up, your moment, moment, I always get confused with the moment, but your, it's your moment. When people are, whoever they are dealing with, is, is it like two cards? No, I felt like two. So there's going to be a wake up and this person is going to wake up and you are going to wake up and then both of you are going to communicate. Okay, I'm telling you that. It's your moment. Something is coming. It's your moment. And use your time well. Is it like the pronunciation is right? Curiouser and curiouser. Discovery, inquiry, weirdness, curiosity. Something might be weird about situation, but the discovery is going to be very authentic and you're going to inquire and they're going to inquire and the curiosity will lead the way. There is this person's hand in your life. That's a masculine energy I can feel. Someone who is around you or they're going to make you feel in a certain way that they're curious about you. Do you feel comfortable? But somehow I feel like in your eyes, it's like doubt. So you're seeking that comfort zone. Unexpectedly, this person is going to be in the zone. They are longing for you. Do you love their touch? If there is no, like even the talk, okay, when they talk and they express, do you love that? Are you comfortable with that? If not, like you're shifting, I feel like. You have shifted recently, okay? Mm, and they are curious about you. So unexpectedly, they are going to be there because they want. But it's not like you don't want this thing to be like creepy, okay? So if something happens around that area, be responsible, take care. But they are, they, they are very much physically attracted to you, uh, fantasizing about you as well, longing for you. They are feeling that possessive nature here. I can see that. Some of you need to follow your own good advice here. Some of you. You people are in separation, not talking. 
maybe from few days to months or weeks it depends time what from your partner is on the horizon but there's going to be sudden contact i'm telling you so if you are okay look at this getting to know each other you'll know this person they'll know because i feel like maybe you've done this part but as you reveal your innermost selves to each other your bond deepens there is some kind of being attentive and uh, you know being there to hear you out love is in the air but do you love their touch do you uh, maybe you have that question of like will i would i if you are literally not in front of each other but they they're fantasizing about you okay they're curious and more curious someone over here is getting more curious about you that's what they're going to tell you look i have feelings for you i cannot deny it i am feeling very romantic towards you they want to kiss you your feelings are real and worth exploring if you do feel that way explore some kind of reconciliation is going to happen here for some of you this person they don't want you to go someone from your past is returning to your life because maybe some of them are interested in taking things ahead way ahead if you're not married they want to give you this promise they want to get married to you in the coming time okay this situation involves marriage i feel like they want to tell you like i have this not like limited i am thinking about making love to you yes i am fantasizing about you can you handle me this is situation is like can you handle me even can go from both the sides but this is about the communication is all about wake up can you handle me and you're like i don't know this is about relationship this is about can you handle my touch it's very deep and intense i know that but someone is so much aware about their own nature and things like that they want to tell you that is there any any how much the intensity is how much is it possible even that's a question that arises um maybe maybe no but yes love is in the air so you decide they decide talk and see where it goes take care and see you soon bye bye